Hi everyone, this is Guilherme and I'd like to share with you this Python script to uh, convert addresses into coordinates. So basically I will upload here a data set that I found publicly from Caixa, it's a Brazilian bank and we have some units here and an address column and a city column. So first thing we're gonna upload this to click and um, let's make some adjustments here and we're gonna come back in a second. So now we can load this table. All I did was to change the name of one of the columns to address and to segment and divide in the slash character and get just the first uh, section of it. So with the subfield formula and then capitalize it as city because we have this column here and we just want the first part. Uh, and then we're going to store this, this table as companies in the same files folder. Okay, so let's run this. And now we have here this companies uh, file. And basically it's the same file, but with slight differences and let's just make it more visual. So basically we have the address and the city, which is what we want to convert to coordinates. Um, now, second part, let's go uh, to our Python script. I'm not an expert in Python, but this code is working. I know it could be way shorter, but uh, I hope it helps someone, basically. So what we're doing here, we're getting the stored file, which is companies.csv uh, from here. And I renamed the columns here to address and city because we are reading them again and finding these columns in the file, in the CSV. So we are reading this file and we're going to make it a data frame. Uh, basically, in this case, we're dealing only with unique records. So uh, we don't have duplicated values here. Uh, so we get these values not from here, but from the CSV that is this file here and we're going to loop them in this URL. So basically this URL comes from uh, Google's developer guide uh, and here it says that we can just change this parameter. So basically we have this query and all we have to do is <clears throat> to loop in the addresses here so if we just uh, use this example, so for example, using here plus name of the city, hit enter, it will automatically <clears throat> find the point and here we have the coordinates. So what we're going to do here is find the first center. So beautiful soup is going to find center, which is here and empty. And then what's in between is going to be used as a string. And we're going to break this into latitude and longitude. Basically, I know that this could be way easier or shorter, but it's working well. Uh, and then we have a, a if statement here. So if it doesn't find anything or if we have an error, if it's not in the standard HTML form uh, as the others, uh, it's just going to be as invalid. And the result is going to be printed and stored in a, an Excel, which is coordinates.xls. So basically, let's run this and show you how it's working. And I'm not using Jupyter yet. So running this file, it's going to enter each one of those rows. So 0, 1, 2, 3. And it gives me the latitude and longitude. And after all of this, it's going to store or create an Excel file with all of these uh, records, okay?
So this is our coordinates table, but how do we connect this to our first table? Basically in click, let's use the resident load. So basically let's load and use the row number. But here it starts in zero and in click, it's going to start in one. So let's do row number minus one as ID. And let's also load code. Uh, from resident, resident source. Oops. And then we're going to load our second table. Uh, its coordinates and then they will be related <coughs> but here we're going to use geomake point in my case i will have to replace dots and commas as coordinates so i don't know if you have to but in my case i have to do this And let's try to run it and create a first map. So basically that is it. Let's just zoom in a, in specific city. Uh, it probably got some some points here wrong, but so basically let's see here San Carlos. How many points do we have? We have here. <clears throat> and we can change the oops the tooltip. Let's show label <clears throat> with the name of the unit. Let's just make a quick check. Conde do Pinhal. this address come on back to Google here because it was just not I couldn't see the uh, yeah here here we go doctor so yeah it's correct so I hope it helps and let me know if you have any questions and uh, or you, you can improve this code and or if you don't think that this is an alternative, let me know as well and see you.